911. What is the address of your emergency? And it's Shelbarger Road. Is there like, he seriously, I mean, besides the drugs, like I know that he's losing his mind. Do they do like a wellness check or something like that? They can while they're out there. Yeah, I need him to, they need to do a wellness check on him because he is losing his mind. Okay, what is he under the influence of? Meth, coke. Okay, we'll have a deputy out there as soon as we can, okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. 911, what is the address of your emergency? My husband, my spouse, he's having a breakdown. He has a gun in his hand. He's in the back. I need somebody at yeah. Shell Barger Road. The sheriffs were at our house earlier today. Okay, and you said he's in the backyard with a gun in his hand? Yes. And is he waving it around? Is he making threats? What's he doing with it? Yes, he's been screaming. He's having a mental, I think he's having a mental breakdown. He's been screaming for hours. He's, he's been having problems with drugs. He's, he's losing it. Do you think that he's under the influence now? Oh, definitely. What kind of firearm does he have? Is it a handgun, a long gun? It's an AR. Is he pointing it at anything? Is he, or is he just holding it? He is holding it, and we, and I am not going back there. Has he made any suicidal statements to you? He has been. He has been um, today. He has been suicide for a while because he has been so depressed. We are going to send somebody there. We will be there as quickly as we can. Okay. Do you need police, fire, or ambulance? Yes, I have already called. Um, my husband's in the back with a lock and loaded gun. Who are on their way. Has anything changed? We've just had uh, some guys show up, like his friends, try to get it out. He will not give it up. Um, we're just staying clear of him. Okay, uh, his friend's going to go back there and try and get it away from him. To one okay. of the other he doesn't neighbors. need to do that. Deputies will be there as soon as they can. They're driving there now. He does not need to put himself in any sort of danger. 911, what's the address of your emergency? Shellabarger Road. Okay, so what is going on there? Um, that's my next door neighbor. Uh, he's drunk. He's got uh, mm -hmm. assault rifle style weapon with him. He's posted up in this white and blue long trailer connected to a truck in the very back of the property. He's yes. in there with his wife right now. 911, what's the address of your emergency? I live in one Shellabarger Road and the na there's a neighbor, um, he said out loud that he has a gun and he has seven rounds and he's going to kill himself. Okay. When did you hear this? It just barely, right now he said it out loud. Patrol and King 2 for information, we can copy Air One's announcements from the ground. Hey, Robert, this is the Kern County Sheriff's Office. Like we said before, you're not in trouble, man. We just are here to help you. Can you please walk toward the sound of my voice with your hands up? We're just here to help you. I get that you're going through something, okay? Nobody wants to hurt you. We want to offer you resources. We have mental health experts to talk to. We have all kinds of things that are here to help you. If you're saying something, I can't hear you. You have a couple options. You can walk towards me to the sound of my voice, your hands up, and we can talk about whatever's going on. Or you can call 911 and we can talk on the phone. Like I said, we're not here to hurt you. We're, you're not in trouble. We're just here to offer you resources and get you some help, man. Robert, as you mentioned, you are not in trouble. We know you're going through something. We just want to help you. Come out with your hands up. 
Mother, we know you're going through a tough time and we want to help you. We have a mental health team that want to talk to you. If you cannot hear us, call 911. If you do hear us, come out and so we can talk to you. Robert, this is the Kern County Sheriff's Office. We know you're going through a tough time and we just want to help you. We have mental health experts here that would like to talk to you and get the help you need. Robert, we know you're going through a tough time right now. We just want to help you. You are not in trouble. Just walk towards us slowly with your hands up so we can talk to you. Robert, you are not in trouble. We just want to help you. I got him. Guns in his hand. Guns in his hand. Zach, you got that rifle? Yeah, I know. I see him. King three guns in his hand. Cocked it. I can't see any point. <laughs> King three guns in his hand. Cocked it. I can't see any point. 